Hello, and welcome to episode one of the Dual Security Documentary. Yeah, basically, we're building a fucking business. We've been doing it for two and a half years. You'll get plenty more details throughout this, but figured, why not start making a documentary and clip stuff up and throw it on social media and just show what we're doing, building a business, not necessarily trying to become billionaires, but just trying to have impact and do stuff and live cool lives. So it's about 6 a.m. on May 27th in Nanaimo, British Columbia, Canada. I recently moved here, still on Airbnb, but got an apartment for June 1st. We got a retreat coming up this week in Denver, Colorado, May 30th to June 3rd. Today on the schedule, we got a Twitch live stream at 8.30, a Patreon call after that, and then an episode. Maybe we'll do a weed review, maybe we'll do a cooking review, maybe we'll do a restaurant review. Who knows? We're just living our lives, building business, doing our best to have fun, and now, to start documenting the process. I'm not sure I'm allowed to do this, but I have a pot of coffee, coffee over here from yesterday. Cold now. I just teapot heater, water heater. I'm gonna put the coffee in there to heat it back up. I think that's fine. Jesus Christ. There's no paper towel in there. Toilet paper. Almost overflowed, so don't do that. Posting season six, episode 30 of Dualistic Unity. Yeah, we have like over 500 episodes. It's called Embracing the Ups and the Downs. Check it out. Once that loads, then I'll head. About 7.50 a.m. walking a raise for our 8.30 live stream and Patreon call. And then I'm out. The views are beautiful. <laughs> Very quiet for the most part, except for on this street, <laughs> especially at this time in the rush hour. Here we are prepping for the live stream, smoking a little, I'm about to smoke a little bit, but you smoke a lot of weed throughout the day. A lot of people think that makes you lazy, but you seem to be pretty productive and energized, so. Yeah, well, you know, it comes down to the fact is if you if you want to be lazy, weed's a really good excuse to be lazy because you relax, which means you're like, oh, I don't want to do all those things I force myself to do the rest of the time. That's the point, you're forcing yourself to do it. Why? Because you feel like you're not enough unless you do. You feel like you have to do these things. That there's this sense of lack unless you do these things. And so, you don't want to, but you make yourself. Which is why when you smoke weed, you don't do it. I don't do it for those reasons. I do things because I love them. I do things because I enjoy my life. I do it because of enthusiasm for living in itself. Which means I can do it relaxed or tense. I just prefer relaxed. So, see you on the live stream. Check it out. We got our schedule on dualistcommunity.com, but we'll get lots more clips in. All right, we're, we're deciding to rename it from the DU documentary to the DU docu-series because technically it's not just one. It's going to be like a daily vlog type thing. But we are getting ready for our live stream. Yeah. There's Amanda. What is up, Amanda? How are you feeling this morning? I am feeling ready. Let's go. Fuck yeah. <laughs> live stream that shit. <laughs> <laughs> just got done with a dope live stream. We're going back and forth with a Christian in the comments and a little smoke break in between we got a patreon tier one video or a fucking group call yeah that's it but you just added a bunch of stuff to our patreon which has a fuckload of shit also oh yeah it's a we had like 20 to 40 hours of group discussions every week that's not including the group discussions we host live five days a week these are all archived videos so we have group discussions going all the way back to I think our second month of podcasting our original Patreon members okay. so if you want to see the behind the scenes stuff where we are growing having conversations with the people in our audience check out Patreon there's literally over a thousand hours of group discussions available patreon.com slash dualistic unity and Amanda you've been on pretty much as many Patreon calls as we have do you have uh, thoughts about Patreon? <laughs> <laughs> absolutely I love it clearly Maybe too much. No, no, not too much. But um, definitely I have enjoyed being there for all the Patreon calls, as many as I could be, because it was a space that was full of potential. And I was very curious to see the directions that it went in. And it surprised me way more than I expected. So highly recommend. Check it out and join the call if you feel extra adventurous. Mm -hmm. We have fun. We have fun. See you on Patreon soon. A little bathroom break between the live stream and our Patreon tier one call. Bear, chilling. What's up, dude? Mirroring each other. And so we would have thought that, like, of course, we had a phase where we thought we were 
the children of earth that we were connected that we were reality like of course we would have come to that it was about 12 21 in the afternoon doing some editing here getting the episode 31 edited and posted season 6 episode 31 yeah i think we're gonna get a walk in pretty soon here and karaoke later so stay tuned for that one of my favorite parts of nanaimo so far are the forests and the parks because they're actually legit parks like this one bowen park right in the middle of town i love this place i walk in here almost every day just to get away from the street and the noise, sit in nature and find my pace, which, as the Tao Te Ching says, in nature nothing is rushed, but everything is done. A beautiful spot. Amanda, any thoughts on Bowen Park? Just appreciation. It, it offers everything, and yet you don't have to look for it. It's just all here. You can make the most of it and appreciate a bird on a branch or just appreciate the fresh air but it's all up to you and it's all worth exploring another perk of bowen all the beautiful wildlife so cool deer they're cool <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna find a flow with this flock oh, yeah. too because it's like live your life but also get content out there. Finer balance. This is just episode one. Tim Hortons, a glorious Hi. place for food and coffee. Hello. Post Tim Hortons, J break. On our way. well with Timbits. Timbit and a J, eh? Okay. Sounds like a good combo. This is just absolutely gorgeous even under this bridge right here low tide look at that we got black bunnies holy shit oh these views are just nuts it's uh downtown in that direction but wow Ooh. carlos o'brien's for a little snacks and pool Mm -hmm. Hell yeah. Great spot. Hi, what do we got here? Potato nachos, otherwise called nachos. Nachos. Not to be confused with nachos or potatoes, because they're their bait. Or potatoes. And uh, when's the karaoke? When did she say the karaoke? Tuesday and Thursday. Okay. 9 p.m. Uh, 9 p.m. 9 p.m. PT. And the sauce is really good too. It's some sort of honey mustard stuff. You getting a clip because Blink 182's new song, One More Time, with the Blink shirt, which Amanda got me. Uh, I had to. I was at a Blink 182 concert. Gotta get a, gotta get a T-shirt for you. And it's dope. I love, I love the rabbit on it. Oh yeah, yeah, all good. We're used to it. They just ran away. <laughs> But we got another perk of Carlos O'Brien's is the motherfucking pool and all the cool uh, quotes on the wall. Yeah, they're good. Where the tongue slips, it speaks the truth. All, what is it? Always a little truth behind it, just kidding. Oh. Look at this spot too, beautiful. Carlos O'Brien, fantastic spot. Is it a Mexican place? Is it an Irish place? It's mostly Irish, I think. Could be Myrish. There it is, the Myrish spot. That seagull has got a crab. Not to be confused with crabs. Maybe seagulls get crabs. Seagulls get busy. <laughs> I'm back at my Airbnb. I'm not sure where to prop it on. I'm just clearing some space on my computer. That was the only thing I was gonna say. And then we ordered some uh, burgers over to Ray's. So I'm gonna head over there for dinner. So I'll probably show you that meal. We usually do a live stream Monday afternoons or an episode. That's usually when we record our classic episodes, but decided not to today. 
and decided just to roam a bit. We're doing the first day of the vlog, get some fun content around Nanaimo. Totally forgot to film anything at our dinner that I said I would, but we just got some <laughs> A&W. Some burgers and onion rings and fries and sweet potato fries oh, with, so good, <laughs> chipotle mayo, which is, have you ever seen sweet potato fries and not chipotle mayo? Never. <laughs> <laughs> One cannot exist without the other. They do not. They're, 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 they're like twins. They, they were separated at birth and now they have found each other they're again. Inseparable. They're conjoined twins, Darren. <laughs> <laughs> okay, ranch with sweet potato fries? I don't, I don't see a ketchup. Nope. Oh, feel free to comment. Forgot to mention like the comment stuff you want to see on the video or want to see us do or mm -hmm. anything like use that comment section. Apparently that's good for, for YouTube. They like when people comment stuff. So even if you just comment like sweet potato fries, period, that's cool. But let me know also if you've ever seen sweet potato fries without Chipotle mayo. And I'm going to stop this clip now. So many bunnies. We got one there, one there. And we're on our way to the Corner Lounge, Monday night karaoke. Karaoke every night, nine to close, which is about 1 a.m. Last call is at 1.15. Try and take a screenshot yes. of uh, <laughs> of that, and then maybe we can keep the I thumbnail. Stopped, so it's just perfect. Just, Beautiful. Just walking, and I was just there capturing it. Nice. Thank you. Back at Timmy H. Another bunny. Uh, Another bunny didn't move at all. Froze. That was his tactic. He didn't even run away. He's like a vigilante bunny. Right. He's big he's fucking big fucking nuts on that dude. <laughs> <laughs> Bunny nuts. Uh, <laughs> nuts. There it is. The corner lounge. Time for some karaoke. Smoke break. <laughs> the end of it. And we gotta put this out. There it is. Let's yo, go. yo. 